throw under if I were here. It's one of life's great mysteries, isn't it? I love, I love, I love movies. And I barely watch them. What? No, you watch a ton of movies, don't you? I used to, and then I moved to LA and everyone ruined it for me. Oh. Uh, Paycheck is a good movie. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm fine with <laughs> you that. You would die on that I would die box. on that hill. Drop the gun. <laughs> what if I told you, mm -hmm. John, that you didn't have to worry about anyone else's opinions on movies? <gasps> or even your own opinions on movies, because we can make our own movies playing the movies. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I've got my hands in my pockets, but I'm reaching out for stars. You told me you were leaving, but you wouldn't go far, and there it was. I love movies. I, well, that's the thing. I brought together all my, all the biggest film buffs of the office, so that way we could do the thing we've always dreamed: run our own Claymation studio. Studio. All right. Yes. Can we change our studio name, or is it Poor Productions? No, we can change that. We can change that. We need to make glandular sure production. Glandular. Thyroid well, production. Let's, let's start with our logo, right? This feels big. Elise Energy. Marks Brothers. Okay. United Goofball Artists. Well, well, well. What do we have yeah. here? Perhaps a movie studio. In uh, sites. Oh, this also feels. This is the Elise section. Okay, well, hang on now. Oh, Patrick. That was a Patrick that Cowboy that Studios. Studios. I like, yeah, I like that. Brown Productions. Yeah. Big Brown Productions. Big Brown Productions. Big Brown, brown Productions. Thing. That's also the ween word. What? What? Brown is ween for cool. Oh, oh, I just trust that. Me. Okay. Oh, that's really brown. <laughs> uh, okay. How many times do you bring up a ween in a sentence and then tell people, just trust me? <laughs> It's the 20s. First things first, we got to put these people in the lifelong contracts. Yeah, okay? yeah. At least yeah. 40, 50 Ranch years. Them up. Yeah, okay? yeah, yeah. Also, one of y'all have to play any part that's me. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. But then eventually we want you, we do <laughs> yeah. eventually want you to be in some sort of role that's magnificent, yeah. but we will not invite you to the awards. Oh, of, of course, of yeah, course. Yeah. Of course, mm -hmm. we, we funded the studio off the success of Birth of a Nation. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> That movie sucks, by the way. <laughs> Bold. <laughs> <laughs> How brave of you to yeah. say, right? Doesn't hold up. Where do we put our stage school? Probably like right here, right? This is our stage school? Yeah. So this is where the children go if we have children yep. uh, productions? Well, I think it's Building like for young, young adults, right? To yeah. be trained in the arts and theater. Oh, so it's not for where the, the kids, like the little rascals, will go get homeschooled. We don't, we don't have a child actor farm, no. Okay. If that's yeah. what you're asking. We need a child actor farm next. Stat. <laughs> <laughs> now, James. This looks a lot yeah. like kind of like a, a sim situation or it something. It is. It's very similar. When do we do we ever go on set and actually right here is the big thing. Film. We're going to oh. build some sets. Well, we're the, we're Brown Productions, which is, you know, usually cowboy western movies, I mm -hmm. assume, cuz that's, be, our, that's yeah. our logo. So you're so, thinking like a graveyard? Ooh. I was thinking more of like an old western town, like a Hell saloon. Beach or Alien Planet and let's reshoot yeah. Cowboys versus Aliens. <laughs> Let's, me, let's, let's get it remake. right this time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do what, what should have been done. It's funny you said that, because I actually, ha uh, for a long time, I had a Cowboys vs. Aliens. That was like my big script idea. Really? But I don't think it'll really work. Wait, you had a Cowboys vs. Aliens movie, even though there's a movie called Cowboys vs. Aliens? Yeah, but this was this predates Cowboys vs. Aliens, okay? Ah, oh, So they okay. ripped off my idea in my brain. Here's mm. how it goes. Just bear with me for one moment. <laughs> all right, I'm bear. <laughs> They're on the chain gang out there in the, in, in the Old South, and they have all these alien weapons. We're like, fuck yeah, we can take over our mean uh, 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 dude, you know? Plantation people, they find another bunker. It's the two s s factions in the Civil War having the same Civil War, but with alien Alien weapon. So are the aliens racist? No, yeah. there's no racism. Have they learned, have they learned racism through the, the slave masters? Yeah. The aliens are all dead. So the aliens don't come back and learn racism. Well, that's the end of the movie is the third act. They is... become racist? No, no, oh. no, there's no racist aliens. Well, maybe actually that would be cool. We should co-write this yeah. together. <laughs> He can't write a white man. He can't yeah, write yeah. it on his own. He's There's like, I really need you to write this with no, me. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> the two sides are already fighting together and then the aliens start coming. So then it's like, oh shit. So that's how they all come together as one. But the people that are racist in the civil war, yeah. they, 
they stop being racist. They don't stop being racist, but they kind of just are like, well, uh, okay. uh, no, I mean, yes, they do actually start being racist. <laughs> this feels like a eleventh hour rewrite. <laughs> you're right; it needs some polishing. Uh, you're not. You're not. No, neither of you are wrong. Anyway, let's go back to the game. Uh, <laughs> well, so I built most of this studio. Most of the studio has been built. It's time to make our first movie. Oh, we got to create an actor. Every good movie starts with a great actor. Here's here are our options: Oliver Moore, 21 years old, mm -hmm. high looks, no physique. Tom, Tom. Tom Denick, oh, come on. Tom Denick, easily stressed, looks, bubbly, action romance. This person has no experience. They're 20 years old. Uh, but they, they love, love alcohol. alcohol. That's that's uh, one of the oh, biggest that, prerequisites for being an old actor. Easily exploited. Yeah. 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 Boom. Totally can pay them in booze. Now we need a director. Oh, the script is done. Also, just so you know, I grabbed someone from the maintenance department and I made them a director. Oh, Perfect. Ooh, okay. Our big ticket item right now is Baggage Boy. <laughs> okay, Hot nice. comedy. The first scene is now being shot. Oh, first scene is being shot from our oh, movie. Look at this okay. hilarious oh, this film. Nice, there we go. The, is this Baggage Man? This is Baggage Boy, yes. Okay, perfect. But yeah, at least at least <laughs> other studio head shows up and constantly calls it Baggage Man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got new sets. Wow, West Saloon. Mm -hmm. What if we put it way out here? There you go, perfect. Uh, yeah. What was the first movie you all hated? I guess for me it was Ghost Dad because that was the first movie I went to see in theaters. I just got scared at the idea of ghosts. Oh, I see, I see. And so, well, who knew? Yeah, because like, right before he dies, like there's the whole like Satan in the cab scene and yeah. everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. I had a feeling. My dad brought me to Steven Soderbergh's uh, Police Academy remake of Solaris by Oh, nice. Oh, the George Clooney I to, one? I wanted to slip my wrist. Did your a, mother know? A nine year old. Did your mother know he was taking you to see Solaris? No, absolutely not. Do you want to tell her? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you want to call her and tell her? <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't need that weight on her shoulders right now. I just want to make that my thing anytime you confess to seeing a movie. Because I know, I know your track record that yeah. I would take you to see movies you weren't supposed to see. Couple of them. I think more than a couple. How do we know that Birth of a Nation didn't hold up, Ryan? Yeah, right? yeah, How yeah. do we know? <laughs> that brought me to the IMAX re-release. <laughs> Remastered. Pun intended. 4DX. Oh, oh, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Christ. Movie's almost done. Baggage nice. Boy's almost done. When do hey. we get to edit it? They're when do we give them the street. pills? When do we give them the pills? And when do we get to edit it? There it is. Release the movie. Hey. Wait. Where, where, well, when, do we go to the screening. premiere? Yeah. It's already been edited? How uh, did this get made? As the head of PR for the studio, I'm going to tell you the editors don't matter. Yeah. Fuck. Here's what the critics are saying. <laughs> They're saying movie quality is less than one star here. <laughs> it's one fifth Final of movie one ratings, star. barely anything. The novelty value was superb, Ooh, but everything okay. else was pretty poor except for the repair of the sets. Let's okay. check it out for ourselves. <laughs> I love, I love Fuck. it. I mean, That's Baggage Boy. There's, they had internet sites. Critics don't have shit. Oh, we should have cigars and go, I loved it. It was great. <laughs> Print it. Oh, some of the reviews here. Go fuck yourself, Christian Vampy. Cam Era says this. Christian Vamp doesn't know, have the experience. Well, he's just fresh off the street. Yeah. Oh, wait. He doesn't have experience. Oh, wait. Christian Vampy is, works for us. He was our actor. He was our lead. Shit. I'm sorry, Christian. We're <laughs> currently the third, or no, the, sorry, the fifth. The fifth largest studio in town. All right. Uh, all fit. I just want to say Cream Boat Creation sounds nice. Oh, yes. I should be working at Maxi Pad Worldwide. No, this is Maxi Pack. <laughs> oh, oh, I read that wrong. Wings would be their first movie. There's Christian Vomp. That's it. We need to push him. Revamp his image. Revamp pay his image. Oh, I love okay. it. I love it. He's French now. Baggage Boy has made $30,000. That's amazing. On his in first 1921. Day? Yeah. Dude, that is like $30 million. Yeah. <laughs> My grandpa loved Cary Grant. Cary Grant was a big star of the era. <laughs> and he had to talk like this, because that's how a man spoke. I thought you were doing a Catherine Hepburn. Ooh, yeah. now, she also kind of sounded like that. <laughs> Everyone sort of sounded like this. Transatlantic. I don't know where that is, but I don't want like it. Christian Vomp, this is our chance to give him a makeover. Oh, perfect. Okay. We can't get him too big for his britches. Yeah. Or his bags. Or so his like bags. a monocle. Ooh, monocle. Perfect, yes. Can you give him two monocles? Yes. Uh, I think those are called glasses, at least. <laughs> that, oh, okay. yes, yes, yes. I want him to stand out in the crowd. Uh, he looks fairly hairless. 
Yeah, that's that's part of it because then he can play any role. Oh, okay. Look, look at those <laughs> they just put makeup and cosmetics on him like he's a like a Mr. Potato. Head. <laughs> <laughs> look at him; he looks <laughs> great. All right, so we can adjust the salaries of some of these stars. We'll start making so all first down. things first. We need more money for the studio heads. Uh, let's not. <laughs> let's give the yeah. Well, I was gonna say the men. Yep. Probably get more. I feel like Ryan's playing like this. This, this, like this is real. <laughs> Our big star. <laughs> this is not real. We got a script. Oh, love lasso. Love lasso. I love that. Someone just dropped that off, or we found it. I remember. Yeah, we found it. it. Sounds like a western. Sixty-seven thousand dollars from Baggage Boy. <laughs> Fuck the reviews. All right, ready movie's ready to go. Okay. Let's go. Everyone, head to set. We're filming a movie. Everyone shut the fuck up! It's over here. I think you made our set too far away. We're having to pay these people to walk to set. But here's the thing, this is gonna we're gonna build a whole ranch out here. Oh, okay. we got some new sets. Wild West Desert, see? Ooh, yeah. I see, like we're it. gonna build the whole the whole Wild West world out here. Our uh brown big brown cinematic universe will be <laughs> will be shot almost entirely here. Big Brown Cinematic Universe sounds like my family reunion. Oh Lord. Now where are all the set PAs locking up sidewalks and stuff, just okay. wasting their livelihoods. <laughs> just being a human ornament. Yeah. How's the movie? We got a star! Holy yeah. shit! We got a star! Oh, holy star. shit! Okay. Look how great beta did! We might have to make over Christian though. Let's Again? take a look. <laughs> yeah, we, and we don't care about the Christian. Let's watch this movie. I love it. <laughs> that movie fucking blew. No, James. that was fantastic. That's my type Poignant. of movie. Boo! Look at this experience. Beta's just getting better and better. Beta it only took seven months to make that. Yeah, that was awesome. The sets used in this movie were clearly in superb condition. Nice. Great. I think we should even use the bad reviews on the, in like the marketing. Well, we just can we just can clip out the things. Yeah. Christian Vampe is a convincing romantic actor. There we yeah. go. Yeah, the yeah, acting yeah. was decidedly. That's all yeah. I need to see. <laughs> Some <laughs> acting from yeah, Christian Bale. Yeah. 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 Big brows taken off. <laughs> Boom, and we're off. Nice. Love lassos doing huge numbers. Are we are we still making money off of uh, Baggage Lasso. Boy, or is that? Oh, my are you kidding me? Baggage Lasso. Boy is 82000 dollars. Oh, power of cinema. This is what they're saying in the trades about us. I'm not going to believe a source that says has the word enema in it. Yeah, mm -hmm. gross. <laughs> Big Brown Productions this is a, a complete, complete dump. dump. Yeah, mm, I don't know we're about making that. good shit. That's what that's what they meant. <laughs> well, we've made two movies where look, they're doing gangbusters here. Twenty yeah. twenty seven thousand dollars. We're fucking swimming in the money like Scrooge McDuck. Mm -hmm. We're doing great. I think we have a pretty good foundation here to build the biggest studio empire of all time. I agree. I agree too. All right. Well, we'll be back next time for more of the movies. I love <laughs> movies. Oh,